live from LA, it's PRS View to you, and we're going to talk to great plastic surgeons from Pakistan, Dr. Fayaz and Dr. Ashad, about their great study on cleft lip management and how we can actually improve that care nationally and internationally. So tell us, how can we make it so that we can get that great care to every place, not only in Pakistan, but everywhere? Cleft lip and palate is one of the major congenital anomaly. Every year we get around 160,000 new cleft patients all over the world. That's a lot. Yeah. And majority of them, they are in the developing nations. I have operated 70 year old patient. Seven zero. You're kidding. 70? Yeah. With grandkids. But he was not operated. That's amazing. They are one, one line away to normal people. If you operate them in time, they can be better than me and you. Right. Otherwise, the society just rejects them. Exactly. They cannot go to school, they cannot play with the peer, they cannot get married. The, their life is ruined. Okay. So how do you, how do the two of you, what have you done that made, you've made so much difference in so many people's lives? You, What's your message? Uh, over the years, I have developed a team which can go to remote hospitals in Pakistan. We also go to Afghanistan where we can uh, develop the operating room. We can develop the recovery and we can operate 50 patients in a day. Do you so, teach the, the yeah, plastic yeah. surgeons there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. As well, which is the right thing to do. Yeah, Whenever we do a cleft camp, usually we uh, involve the local surgeons also. You do? And we so do. you teach them Some, how to do it? Because in most of the part of the uh, Pakistan, we do not have plastic surgeons. The population of plastic surgeons, we are about 200 plastic surgeons in all over Pakistan. 200 for how Plus, many million? 200 million. <laughs> so tell me, what is your message? Um, to plastic surgeons worldwide and how they can help do what you guys do in Pakistan so that that 70 year old can do it under seven weeks, not 70 years. What do you say to them? Our model is very much reproducible. The main thing that we have developed a regular team. Right. If we develop a occasional team, they do not know each other. They, they do not know the language. There are many barriers. If they can develop their own national team, right. people know each other, people know each other's capabilities, so they can produce, they can operate more patients in a sh sh short span of time. I like that. Yeah. You're a good doctor. Yeah. Thank you. I like good doctors. Thank you. So, live from LA, an incredible lesson on how to give back. I'm very proud to know these incredible plastic surgeons from Pakistan. Get your team, develop your team in your native country, and it's for people like this that give back that makes me proud to be a plastic surgeon.